What's up, guys? I'm Rasim from RossBirdTech.com, and today I got some awesome news. Today we're finally going to get a chance to code in assembly. Now, if you guys have been following me up until now, I've been teaching you the ins and outs of the programming language, but now we're finally going to get a chance to get our feet wet. Now, before we do anything, we got to download a program called MU8086. Now, we're going to open up our browser. In, this, in the address bar, we're going to type in www.emu8086.com. Hit enter. Now this is their main page. You're going to make sure you click on this yellow download link here. It's going to start downloading. Once it's finished downloading, you're going to extract the file into a folder. So you're going to let your file download. You're going to open up the folder where you extracted the file. You're going to click on the setup file and double click it. Click yes. Now I'm not going to install mine because I already have mine installed, but you're going to click next, next, yes, yes, next. But after it's finished downloading, you'll see a uh, MU8086 icon on your desktop. That means the download has been installed successfully. Now, so let's get started. Let's click on this link here. You're gonna wanna register the product. This is a free software, but you're still gonna wanna register it. Now, the first program we're gonna run is a Hello World program. Now, I already have a sample code that I'm gonna paste here. I'm gonna also leave this sample code on my website and also on the description of this video. Now I'm going to explain to you guys what each section is doing. All right, guys, so let's get started. I'm going to describe to you everything that's going on. This first part here, we have a model of Tiny. The second part here, this is the code segment. The third part here, we're telling the program that we're starting off with an offset of 100H. This here is the main PRC mirror. And under here is the main stuff here. This is the, all the stuff that's going to be uh, moving different values between the different registers. So let's get started with this first part here. This is move command. This is moving the value of 0, 9, H into the register AH here. So this is moving this value into this register here. This is uh, the code for function to display a string. The second part here is moving the value of the offset message to the register DX. This is letting you know uh, that there's a string present and it'll ter terminate the string with this dollar symbol. So if you want to end the string, you have to end it with this uh, dollar symbol or else it's just going to print out a bunch of weird characters. This third part here is the INC21H. This initiates the process. You do that before every like command, basically. Uh, this, this next part here is moving the value of 4CH into the register AH. This is the function to terminate. This next part here, we're moving the value of 00, zero into the register AL. And uh, we're using the INT21H again to initiate that. Now, we're ending P here. This is ending the program here. But now here, this is where we're writing our message. We have to start off by writing message, hit space, write our data type, which is DB, hit space, we got to use these uh, quotation marks to write our message in. So our, our message is going to be between these quotation marks. Our message here is hello world. And again, you have to end each string with this dollar symbol here. And this here, it's going to end the program. So let's test it out. I'm going to hit compile. I'm going to hit save. Now let's hit run. I'm going to press OK. As you can see, it worked. It printed out hello world. Now again, I'm going to leave the sample code on my website and also in the description of this uh, video. So if you guys want to test it out. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. And also please subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. I'm Rasim from RossMareTech.com and thanks for watching.